Okay, so we play on this marshy land here, this watery area. Some of the buildings left, but back in USSR times, when they built hydroelectric power plants, they used to flood vast areas of land, even settlements. Uh, so this is an example of such a... So there's plenty of wildlife. Sometimes the military would do raids here. You can shoot down birds. I need to be accurate with that. Uh, we won't be filming this so far, because I might be inaccurate. Uh-oh. You can try hiding in the bush here. helicopter just flew away. So we'll explore the area around here and there is a basing of clear sky. So this level as opposed to E3 demo is much more like widespread uh, spread out and atmospheric is more Stalker, classic stalker-like level. Uh, the faction is being uh, oppressed by bandits who are trying to possess this area. And there was this. Uh, here we demonstrate uh, part of this global war of factions, where factions fight for territories. The bandits try to capture this area here. First. Preparatory combat stage where characters can, NPCs can occupy the positions, uh, look out from behind covers, fight effectively. So many. All right, everybody down. So we talked to the grouping commander. Here he is. The situation is this: bandits established <laughs> I did the control over marshes which is and cut. Real bad. <laughs> so now our. He gave me the task to go with the squad and capture this tower, which is also controlled by bandits. Um, and we get to fight over territories, capturing point by point and establishing control over the area. So characters also know uh, which type of land uh, they are walking by, so they uh, can run around certain areas and uh, if there is danger or something and they need to be quiet, they will be crawling. Silence. Shouting sound like silence, so we go real slow so we try going with them stand by mercenary awaiting your action so back again they are occupying the positions for the fight and uh, there's depth of field effect when you reload. There's also, uh, you can see that with the distance, there's depth of field stuff. So we'll try to uh, go around. <laughs> they were surprised. But our guys are attacking from that end there. They helped. 
Now we'll see them slowly approaching to this position, to this area here. Uh, so as we captured it, now we need to take control over the, and uh, ensure that it is under our control because enemies might try to retaliate and uh, regain the, the control over this area here. Task accomplished. The tower is under our control. Now we need to hold our ground. Mercenary, rush to the tower and keep your eyes open. Mercenary is me, so I'm going to keep, to keep my eyes open. <laughs> Take the binoculars. This level is real big, uh, and we're, what we see now is only part of that. Um, it's not a good overview, I'll just go upwards and show you what's there. There's a ruined church there. Oh, these must be bandits. Okay, but we, we are well prepared. Our guys are there on positions here in, in the camp. So once we've captured new territories, our faction gets more powerful um, and hence we can recruit more newbies and uh, get equipped with new stuff, new gear, new weapons. There they are. Speed up the weather a little bit, the time. There's uh, one new feature I wanted to demonstrate. This volumetric light. So now you can see objects casting really beautiful, nice shadows. You can have things like this here. Sorry. Um, so which all adds to like more beautiful and realistic picture. We change the water effect here as well. All that stuff. The sun now goes all the way up the skyline and all the lighting is fully dynamic, so you can, uh, can destroy lamps, you can uh, see that every object is casting shadows. Okay, the goal of this uh, level, of this demo, is to capture a factory which is somewhere there, um, back again, regain it from the control of bandits. However, on the way there, there is there's my squad, friendly one, waiting uh, to pass, but. Here it's blocked by some wild boars, wild pigs. So I'm trying to help them. Just killing the boars. It's like hunting simulator. <laughs> So now we'll see our guys moving forward, advancing. I'm going to help them. 